This is Camp Kennedy. Yo, what's going on everybody? Kenny here and I'm pretty excited because I'm going to do an unboxing video. Uh, really stoked about this uh, because in here is one of my bucket list uh, creatures. And uh, I'll just give you a quick update or fill you in on how this all came about. So two weeks ago, a good friend of mine, Robin Marklin, uh, came to visit along with Chad Brown. Now, those two guys uh, run and operate uh, the Reptile Report and Ship Your Reptiles. And uh, Robin has been down here before, and uh, he's a good buddy of mine. I've known him for many, many years. We both love BMX, love mountain bike riding, so uh, that uh, definitely connects us, in addition to the love of reptiles. So anyhow, he came down, saw some of the uh, snakes I have. I mentioned I liked a certain species, and uh, he texted me and said that he knew somebody who was getting rid of one. Uh, they wanted to sell it, but instead, um, Robin uh, bought it and sent it to me, man. I can't believe this. So let's unbox it. Let's see what's going on here. I'm pretty stoked. Oh my God, I'll show you guys what it is and we'll learn a little bit about it as well. This is gnarly. Oh man. Okay. So first thing I'll notice here, we got our wildlife importation application permit here, uh, all stamped and sealed from Florida Fish and Wildlife. We had to go online and uh, get this. Uh, so any animal coming into the state of Florida has to have this no cost permit, which it does. Oh uh, guys, here we go, here we go. I wonder what it is. What do you guys think it is? What's in the box? What's in the box? Okay, so we just have to undo this zip tie and uh, try not to cut myself. This is not easy. This is a darn good zip tie they got here. We don't want any escapies. Oh, I hope she's all right. It is a female and uh, we're gonna have a peek in. Oh my god. This is unreal people. This is unreal. I don't know what her temperament is but uh, you're about to find out, as well as I, it is a gorgeous, gorgeous diamond python. This is a snake that I always wanted. Look at this snake. Oh my God, this is insane. Woo! So it's a diamond python, and these guys are uh, indigenous to southeastern Australia. They're actually the furthest uh, species or the furthest south you'll find any species of python uh, these guys actually can hibernate because it gets pretty cold down there in southeastern Australia in their winter uh, this snake loves uh, the cooler temps and that's why it has this really nice beautiful dark coloration because it can absorb all of that solar radiation to warm itself up even on cooler days uh, this snake is semi-arboreal. In fact, it's a member of the carpet python genus. It's Morelia spilotus pelota, uh, but a gorgeous animal. This particular animal is 20 years old. So uh, here's hoping she's got a few more years left in her. Uh, basically, they wanted to get her to a good home, and so that's why she's here with me at Camp Kennan. This is a snake that I, I absolutely love because I know I can keep this snake outdoors here in South Florida year long. Uh, they actually need a bit of a cool in order to go into breed. Um, I would love to get a male for her, but at this point we're going to put her in with Colin. Uh, there is a natural intergrade in the northern part of their range uh, with coastal carpet pythons, so it's no big deal. If they do have babies, there'll be crosses, there'll be coastal diamond crosses, but I do want to locate a male for this female here and hopefully get some babies out. Look at her, she is just gorgeous. What a nice temperament, similar to Colin. Uh, I was thinking, since she's a little bit older, she's a 20 year old gal, I was thinking of names for her uh, and I thought it would be fun to call her Ethel. So uh, I am just blown away at this animal and its beauty. Uh, looks like she made the trip. Once again, Ship Your Reptiles, a fantastic service. If you guys want to ship your reptiles, go to shipyourreptiles.com and check them out. They're all I use when I ship my tortoises. Uh, they have great uh, supplies and a great service to give you the best prices 
on any of your reptile shipping needs. Uh, and I am definitely plugging those guys because come on, let's face it, I've known them for a long time. I've had no DOAs using their service and uh, they just sent me, uh, Robin just sent me one heck of a gift. I mean, just you just heard me in passing mention I love diamond pythons and now I have one and her name is Ethel and I think she likes me. How cool. I hope you're in a good mood, Ethel. I know you've been kind of jostled around for the last 24 hours. I'll tell you what, why don't I pick you guys up and we'll walk on over and check her out as we put her into the enclosure. Now, she is gonna go in with Colin. I did some, uh, I did do some fun things to the enclosure. I actually um, dressed it up a little bit for her arrival because you know what, Colin's not gonna be a bachelor anymore. Uh, much like me, Kate comes over and she saw a lot of things that needed doing at the house. So a female needs a specific touch. So I planted a few plants and uh, well, I made sure Oh, let's just look at her. Let's put her down and just look at her in this beautiful grass. Look at her feeling the grass here. This is awesome. Look at this snake. What a gorgeous, gorgeous representation. Oh my gosh, I'm so stoked. I can't believe this. And she is so chill. The diamond python, guys. This is incredible. I got to find a male. Hooey. How incredible uh yeah so like i said these guys uh semi-arboreal they're cooler they can take cooler temps which is again to reiterate why i like that i like keeping animals that i can keep outdoor year round um oh my gosh so cool just check her out Whew, so okay let's get her going pick her up here come on sweetheart i gotta bring you over so you can see your new roommate colin <laughs> This is awesome. Look at her go. All right, so there's the enclosure. Colin's over here. We'll see how they do. Colin's a gentleman. I put some elephant ear in there. We have a cave behind that rock. I'm gonna put you guys down just for one second while I open this, and let's get her to exploring this awesome enclosure. All right, let's put her on in and see what she does. See what Colin does. There he is, and here she is. God, it's so beautiful. Look at her go. We got some bromeliads in there. Oh, yeah. So rad. Oh, my gosh. Loving this. Hey, Cole, you got a new gal friend. All right. So there you have it, man. That is so cool. So she's going to get used to this place. Uh, the cave is right in there. It's, it's kind of cool. Like, I basically, what did I do? I basically, I'm going to walk in here. Um, what I did was I just hid that, see? So it's got the open, it's got some leaf litter, but I just put this up here and the snakes can slither through that hole and feel real secure. Look at her as she moves around the enclosure, just checking it out. This is gonna be your new place, Sweet Pea. Oh my gosh, you're awesome. Ethel or Sweet Pea, what do you guys think? I love it. Uh, come up with some names down below in the comments. And as always, thanks so much for your support here at Camp Ken. I wanna shout out to my buddy, Robin Marklin. Thank you so much, I am just beyond thrilled, man. Uh, and if you guys would do me a favor, go check out the Reptile Report on Facebook. Give it a like and head on over to shipyourreptiles.com anytime you need to ship a awesome reptile of yours safely and securely with some of their incredible um, supplies to make sure the animal arrives alive. And don't forget to go to Camp Ken and uh, hit like if you liked the video. Hit subscribe if you want to be continually updated on new videos. Go to the Camp Kennan Army and subscribe. A lot of videos floating up there. A lot of surprises also. And if you'd like to support Camp Kennan, go to patreon.com slash Camp Kennan for more content that you can't find anywhere else. All right, everybody, there she is. My little sweet pea, Ethel. Oh, yeah. All right, well, hey, Carl, what you looking at, buddy? <laughs> so Colin's up here. He knows something's going on. Maybe he's going to come crawl on my head. I just don't know. But these two snakes, hopefully, are going to have a fun time together. And that'll do it. All right, everybody. I'm signing off. It is I, Kenan. Oh, looking down at you while you, you all look up at my nose. I'm not really looking down at you. How's that? Now you're looking down at me. See you guys later. So long, everyone.